Hi, I'm Thad Altman. I'm from Senate District 24. Uh, Senate District 24 basically encompasses East Central Florida. I'm here to talk to you about child safety, in particular uh, the safety of our children and our vehicles. Presently in Florida, an infant from age one to three must be seated in a child safety seat. But unfortunately, we don't address the problem when a child becomes four, particularly ages four to seven. Children of this age, is, they're not large enough to be properly fitted into an adult seat belt. What happens when they sit in an adult seat belt, that strap comes across their neck and it goes across their belly. So in, even in a small accident, that child's thrust into that seat belt uh, can cause severe neck injuries and, and, and can cause severe abdominal injuries. The solution to that is to fit uh, your seat into a properly fitted booster seat. A very simple device, could be as uh, little as $16 to buy, and, and, and anyone who doesn't have the money to buy them, they're pretty much available for free. That elevates that child, brings them up four or five inches so the adult seat belt fits them properly. Uh, we're trying to provide uh, in Florida Senate Bill 238 a requirement in law that those children four to age seven or below four feet nine inches to be in a booster seat. Uh, a lot of parents don't realize, they know it's the law, they must buckle their, their four or five, six year olds up, but they don't realize if they're not in a booster seat, their children are not safe. They are actually five times more likely to be injured in a crash. So Senate Bill 238 simply puts into law that children of, of that age group, four to seven, must be in a booster seat. We want to get the word out. Uh, we're not intending to be punitive here. What, we're most, what we most want to do is educate the parents to let them know that children are not safe in an adult seat belt from ages four to seven.